spring is here, but the winter is trying to stay. Good boy. This is a good boy. Figaro is here again. Look at his bud. They're bigger. He tried to get our attention every single day. Bye, Figaro. Yeah, the apprentice is in the back. He's still afraid of us because he doesn't. He doesn't know us. But he's bringing his boy every single day here. <laughs> Sorry for the mess. We are busy doing other things. But now Figaro is looking for my husband. My husband is in the basement. He's working for the wiring. Yeah, he's waiting for my husband. I can't believe it. He's like, where is your husband? Yeah, I don't want to yell at him because I'm going to scare Figaro. Bye, Figaro. Today we are helping our community installing a ham radio antenna that is on a different mountain top. up there because we're going to stand it up we'll figure where we're going to drill it and then we'll we'll break it down put it all together and then we'll stand it up where do you want me to put it Same there. right down here oh, okay. this is a commercial tower it's like like a rolling 25g That's the repeater. Yeah. Oh, this is the ham room. This is all the all the ham stuff. Wow. So exciting for me. Huh? It's exciting for me. I haven't yeah. been. This is the this is the power supply. There's a backup bag. Yeah, back up batteries. Uh, this one is 3.9. We're going to replace that. This is the link radio. Um, this is the DMR radio. This is the UHF repeater. This here. And this is the GMRS repeater. Oh, it's not that big. Huh? It's not that big. It goes into a power amplifier. That's a half watt repeater? That yeah. one? Okay. Just like the one we're replacing is a half a watt, but it'll go into a power supply. And then these are the duplexers. So you can transmit and receive 
simultaneously yeah. on the same antenna. Then all the rest of this stuff is the top shop and uh, stuff. That's T-Mobile. That's T-Mobile. We'll find T-Mobile. We have T-Mobile. <laughs> that antenna there is coming down. The one co-partner is already down, but it's going to go back up at least until the new stuff comes. It's been ordered. It'll be here. Don ordered it. The antenna. There's three of them up. One, two, and then three. Yeah. Paul and I, I made the, I made the cross arms. <laughs> oh, the blue one. Yeah, the blue ones in yeah. there. I made the cross arms, and then Paul and I, I climbed the tower. He was my grand guy. We installed those for the county. I'm in the top of the world. <laughs> there is Canada. We're at the border. Whew. Amazing. This is nice country. It's so beautiful in here. There is Canada. We can walk there if we want to, right? It's super close. To nice views. We are helping the ham radio to put a new tower here, a repeater tower, and they needed help. And I guess I'm helping. <laughs> no, my husband is. I'm just tagging along. What are you doing, honey? I don't know. <laughs> you don't know? <laughs> he doesn't so know what he's doing. Do this and uh, make the holes. Yes, but I gotta have it. So this hits the wall. So I gotta find out from the wall. Ah, how far the, this oh, okay, okay. Don made and installed many towers. Yet for me, it is first. In the beginning, we prefit all components for the base to make the installation easy. Next step is to assemble all the three sections of the antenna together and secure it on a concrete pad and to the building. And like in every working site, more help is needed, so we got the wiggling tail. Now the tower is ready to go up. Yeah. 
let him get it on the concrete. Well, I'd say about, about $31. Okay. Rotate it. There you go. Uh, I'd be able to go all the way to here. Yep. Yeah. Uh, just rotate it over. There you go. So, hey, Joel. Awesome. Thank you for reaching. Yeah, that'll work. Brian is the youngest of us and he was pulling by himself the antenna. <laughs> Not really. We were two guys pulling the rope behind him. Now we are securing the antenna on the building on both sides, inside and outside. The old temporary antennas are going down. Now Brian has the most important job to perform, installing the actual antenna on the tower and we make sure he was secure with a rope to the tower. Good 
That's the test. That's the test. The tower is holding. Oh yeah. We are not failing. <laughs> Is that antenna like a bluish color? Yeah, it is. Did I mention that I don't like heights? I think this is the tool box, right? Yes, that's the tool box. I managed it anyway. And I got to go up in the fire lookout for better views of the area. This was possible due to Don's involvement with the Ham community and his tower donation. Thanks Don for all you do for the community and for the Ham radio classes that you organize voluntarily. <laughs> Thank you everyone for watching and subscribing.